Hello, well, we're back. You missed a few months. I got excited and hit on pause. Um, so we're testing something. I... Mostly I want this. Uh, if I get to 30 bureaucratic influence or 30 or greater, hopefully this works. I get to click the button. Which is a hell of a lot better than getting it to absolute, absolutism 20. Or 15. Either way, pain. Because we're going at the speed of snail. <laughs> now that's said, we should probably think about investing in Stenton here. How are we doing? No, it's at 10,000 actually. And you don't have higher education, you say. Literati? Literati. Enough. And slots. Slots. Whoa, whoa. Whoa. Ah, uh, here we go. Six. Start learning all the hotkeys again. Stenton. Here. Education is pretty good, so it should get the development up. Mm. That doesn't seem good. But this seems a little bit easier to deal with. We're not doing reforms anytime soon, are we? We probably could, if we could expand it a bit. Yeah, we're at plus two. With their interest, and when this ticks up... Uh, we can support the peasantry, so we could start freeing them a bit. Now this will weaken the nobility, I think, very slowly. That's uh Can we do anything else here? How quickly does this go down? It's kind of going up. So we're gonna wait until bureaucrats upgrade, update. Caravan power. Merchant trade power unlocks commerce rights leading to commercialization. Is that what I'm missing? Yes. I am missing all of that. And metropolitan influence at 30. Because I want them to be better too. So we'll try to align with them next. Yeah, we'll align with them next. And we will give them... Modify their merchant protection. Commercial law. Do I want to protect the presentry now? Base welfare is good. That actually, I believe, helps with... Unrest, if I look here. Here. So, they're angry. And you can see here, welfare is under banditry. Also under our uh, rebellion. Now, the suppression is pretty high, but we can get this lower, and this will be statewide. So, I'm thinking we want to protect the peasant. Yeah, well... We're not going to war anytime soon, so support the nobility. Um, hold some celebrations. <sighs> now overlook uh, tenant abuse. How quickly? Oh, nobles are really strong, so that'd be pretty high. What is, how do I, what is noble power like in, say, Mithilmark? Uh, power. High as hell. So, they would fully demolish peasant freedoms pretty quickly. I'll free my peasants. Not too free. But, uh, 
They, I don't think they need to be list free. We don't have a whole lot of legitimacy to play around with. We do have at least eight. It is growing. We have a strong on the next one. Can we not have an air so we can start looking around? Yeah, I'll take it. I'll just own an unpopular relative of a dynasty that is not my own. Now, we don't want to do that all the time. Uh, because legitimacy grows very slowly. But we can do it every so often. Once we're close to 60. I don't think, yeah, there's nothing negative really around this point. Oh, Frankfurt, that's actually pretty close by. <laughs> Military technology. By the way, like, institutions no longer, like, slow you down, but the ahead of... Is it ahead of time? There's something else that increases the cost. As you can see, this cost, even, like, at just plus five, this costs, like, 833. If I go in here, increase over time gets astronomically high, so... If you don't keep up with reforms... Over time, you're going to start falling behind, like the Teutons here. Actually, we're pretty far behind. <laughs> like, militarily, we're not doing okay, but since I'm, like... Look at how far ahead these guys are. Scotland is a backwater. Actually, we're pretty bad, aside from our military. Whatever. More guns! <laughs> we'll be doing pretty well once we pick up commercialization. So that's a hundred percent off. Oh, um, Mepper updated his Theotrum Orbis Terrarum, and I was a fan of that in my last playthrough, so I picked that up again. It's also out for 2.52 uh, MNT. Uh, I do like it. I just had to uh, readjust myself to the forts. <laughs> Because <clears throat> that's not how they look in. I have a free diplomat. Ah, what am I going to do with you? Well, they broke free and now they're back under. What the? F Flop. Flop, yes, that's what I'm going to go with. And you're still goddamn alive with it. Hell with that alliance. I need a good ally. So what you're saying is, if I get rid of my ally of Bohemia, you would join it. I feel like that might be a poor life decision. Fucking wall gas. That's all I gotta say. Okay. We're gonna deal with Rupin then. Uh, Brunswick and Saxony. Brunswick... Loonberg, they probably got like 2,000, so we're gonna, probably going to deal with like, not too much. And we got this really good general still, and he is not getting any younger. I take less damage. Man, I love you. I mean, it can be. But, I'm not used to seeing Wolgas so aggressive. This is new to me, uh, and it's both, like, good and bad for me. It's 
not like we get any of the military bonuses that we used to get. Uh, definitely in my old campaign. Uh, that was before they did all the changes to ideas. So they're no longer decked out with like 5 million military boosting national ideas. Yeah, we're going to war. Take Rupin, Brooks, Saxony. Going up. Is that an actual fort? Son of a. Late Luton. Do we have enough? No, we don't. Nine! Holy sh. Alright. Well, our vassals come here. And our ally gets his ass over here. I think we'll be alright. And if we can get that cannon, we'll be golden. Though, might be better. I mean, I'm making a whole decade a month. What are you doing with commercialization? I would really like to have that now. Hurry up! Yeah, at least the smaller neighbors, which is all I've been picking on over the time. Ah, oh, come on, get over here, you dumbass. Eh, if I go over. Two more, I'll be at nine. I have the money. Uh, uh, let's pick. Rupin is a tough nut to crack, apparently. They decide to have a fort. I mean, arguably, I could start building those too. Leaning towards Magdeburg. Get over here. Support the burgers. Nothing? Well, we'll get around to that. Donate. Ports. How long would this last? Five years? I could do that for a bit. I don't like losing that army tradition, so maybe I'll avoid that. Yeah. I mean, Poland, Lithuania, the Teutons are no longer as weak as they used to be. We're struggling to field 9,000. We saw Teutons walk around with 16,000 to help Wolgas conquer over here. Well, I can't see the Timurids, so... We're not doing as well as that one... I think it was Mepper? Mepper was showing it off, I think. Or was it Fire Kahuna? One of the two had a... rip campaign as the Tims. <sighs> Main issue is... The Teutons are more than happy to help... Gast. <sighs> I'd be okay if I can get the Bohemians in, but that requires me to declare war on the Teutons. I don't think I can reach, and they're allied with the Bohemians, so they would side with the Bohemians. Fuck you! Who else are you allied with? Hamburg. We take Loomberg, we could start working on Hamburg. Or not, because it's part of the damn Lubeck trade node. And that would be a whole lot of 1000s. Oh, thank god, we're finally ticking away at this stupid defense, and we're almost out of manpower. 
Great. Currently 74. Oh my god. Fall, oh, damn you. I think I'll, I'll just be done with Rupin. I'll just call it a day. Oh, thank god. Alright. No? Saxony? Small level garrison. Saxony is probably what we can do. How many do we need? Four. Keep five. Five for now. Actually, how much do we have backed up? I'm getting another one here. How much are we over my limit? We'll just get one, put a thousand back in our pool. <sighs> All right. God, I need better military uh, reforms. Oh, corruption's still going up. That's not nice. I really do need more meritocratic uh, reforms. <sighs> oh, wow. It is almost 11. Yeah, this will be our last little bit. I'll try to wrap up this war. Two whole ducats. Yeah, this was a capital and <laughs> all. Yeah, it was the capital of the garrison and the and the castle itself. That's brutal. Port. Tiny little Brandenburg, it's rather brutal. Like, I look impressive, I am not impressive. The nobles own most of the country. <laughs> Damn nobility. Oh, please. That's corruption. Please. Ah, <sighs> oh, we do have manpower, so we'll deal with that. Now, if I vassalize you as well, so if I vassalize Saxony and I took Rupin, we're only dealing with thirteen. So far, not doing bad. I want to see if we can like peel away Lunenburg. So maybe Lubeck will screw up with its legitimate, its uh, Republican tradition and become a monarchy. That would make me happy. I'd be very happy if they did that. Of 
question. Good, we can support all this. <laughs> if I just did this separately. Yeah, that's fine. Uh, that's just 2,000 guys walking around. Can't really do too much damage unless they go over here. And I'll get rid of that ally at the end of this. They only bring about 1,000 to the fight. And uh, they're not a guarantee. I couldn't annex these guys right now. Shame, I really want to use them for their themes. Now just stay over here, far away from doing me any actual damage. Yeah, you're bisphor bisphoric. Can't pronounce that word for the life of me. Okay, now we got this up to two. Great. Now the residents can grow and not die. Actually, we probably want to just... Uh... If I just use that, this works just as well. It does. Okay. Uh, design the project. Improve. I get this to three. How much? Yep. Yep. That's well outside our budget. <laughs> Six hundred and seventy-eight. We need to like loop Prague to the ground to get that kind of cash. Now, do we want to push our luck? If I take this and them. No, we don't have the Diplosoft. Well, we could eat Wismar, like Mechelblair and Fern. Lose their court. I vassalize you. Would you keep them? Probably not. Let's just take your war reps and go. Right, don't do that. Way too much. These guys will take though. Keep being my shield, because you're not going to help me expand in the Empire. You can at least do that. Okay, what are we looking at? Force limit wise. Back down to four, so we can probably sit around five. I'm so happy that I just cost a ducat. 
much easier to manage. Shameful affair. A shameful affair. Support the burgers. Commerce. Uh, nope, that's fine. With the nobility. I mean, you guys are already incredibly powerful, so I'd rather not. And you're still getting stronger, so I don't think you need a boost. <sighs> Stability drop. I'll have that. This. This. Except. Just have a bunch of angry rebels right now. Potential rebels. All because of that stupid pull tax. Give me that trade. Yeah, I really do need better, like, direct taxation. And I probably just centralize. Centralized tax farming! Should unlock that, I think. Basically, I just want to do less pull tax. Uh, direct taxation? Yeah. Oh no, you need to just be... Or is it on? Is there a, under tax collection? Huh. Yeah. Basically, we need to move away from tolls because uh, tolls, toll tax, because it is brutal. Apparently, peasants don't like that. Who oh, no. knew? What do I need for that? Or, okay. So, the next time my guy dies, we need to... Which I think I'll do one more episode after this. Something, something, peasants war. Yeah, pretty much. 